and part four of what to look for when you are fresh out of school and you're looking for a trucking job. Say you do not go OTR, which is over the road, and you choose to be local home every day. You want to look at the hours. You want to see what their start times are and what their end times are. Are they on a day shift schedule, a midday schedule, or a night shift schedule? Because you could go to a company and think it's a daytime position, but it could end up actually being a overnight position or a midday spot. And if that's not what you want and you want something that's essentially Monday through Friday during the day, you need to look at that. And you also need to look at the job listings because usually they state it, but if they don't, you definitely want to ask about it. But you want to ask questions like, what time do you start in the morning? What time should I be expected to come in? And what time do we typically come back in in the afternoons? Especially if you have things that you might have to do, like you may have to pick up your child from childcare or whatever the case is may be. You want to ask about their start and their end time. Just because you want to be able to go in and fully understand what you are getting yourself into when it comes to the hours. And also, you want to ask, do they give overtime? And if they pay the overtime pay, but that'll be for a whole other thing. And you want to get a rough idea. Do they run typically full 40 hour weeks? 50 hour weeks, 60 hour weeks, and are there any on calls depending on the type of job that you are going for? Like a lot of fuel trucks will do on calls. So if you get into that, you want to ask about it. Or if you are in the construction field, you want to ask about if they do any night work or weekend work if that's something that you would be interested in but it's also good to know so always ask about the hours what time in what time out if there's any overtime and if there's any night night work or on call